morning. Good morning, guys. Good morning. So if you guys didn't see real good in the video the other day, this is the vase that I just bought from Ikea on Friday. And that's the sheepskin. This is the set of cups. This is my gap purse that just came. And the shoes is in that box. I still got a mess of stuff I bought. I still got the JC Penny sheets on the floor. The pillowcases. My mom's gifts is still in the corner. My Christmas decoration is still up. Even though I said I would take it up right afterwards. I didn't. They're still up. So yeah guys, this is Brownie from Manhattan, New York. So I'm coming to you guys with what did I make for breakfast. So this morning for breakfast, I decided to eat something that was healthy. So I added some avocado pieces, chunks, with some eggs. I used the whole entire egg instead of the egg white this time. Um, some dumplings, which is like a typical... This could be considered a, a West Indian breakfast, but it's good for anybody. Um, basically, you fry the dumplings, fry the eggs, cut up the avocado, put it in the middle so that the heat from the eggs doesn't melt them down, kind of like. So this is how it looks, guys, from the top. And you want to make sure you use paper towel and soak out the oil from the dumpling and the eggs before eating them. Unlike when you buy them outside, you can't do that, you know. So, yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. This is basically my Christmas decoration still up. I'm going to grab some paper towel. So I'm going in the kids' room. I'll be taking on this furniture soon. My daughter's bed, my son's bed, my son's dresser, my daughter's dresser. And I'm grabbing a paper towel. Gavin a paper towel. I got a stock up on toilet tissue, guys. I'm like, Bella said good morning, guys. She said good morning. Yeah, so this is my new wet back. Um, my steam mop, which I wanted forever. This is the best gift ever. My steam mop. It like made my day. So as you guys know, I'm kind of having a rough time. You know, I was just engaged for the past two years. I bought a New Year's with my fiance. So this is the first year. Well, for the past two years, I bought a New Year's with my son and my daughter. And then I bought a New Year's with my fiance minus my kids. And then my fiance again, and now it's just me. So it's like a big change. It's a big, big, huge change. I woke up like this, by the way. I woke up like this. So this is my first New Year's in a while, bringing it in by myself and Christmas by myself. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorials. Um, hopefully one day I'll be able to share my story with you guys so that it might be able to be inspiring to you guys. Um, just one thing, if you're not getting treated the way you're supposed to be treated, always soar for the best. Um, if those of you who watched my channel, you know I was on People's Court on November 13th episode of 2014, so you could always go check that out. And that's basically where I was suing him for stuff that he stole and things that he did to me that was wrong. Um, you know, a couple of times during the relationship, he did hold me down and rape me. And, like, I just kept putting up with this stuff, you know, and kept taking it and believing I liked the better part of him than to see the bad part of him better. So, yeah. But this is a transition. I have transferred back to my college I was before private college so this is a kind of like a mini transition look outside guys i wish it was snowing again it stopped snowing can, can you guys see outside i live off a of second avenue in manhattan let me see if i can see the trump sign to show you guys on this building that's trump's old office yeah it's not saying it right now so i'm where the money's at <laughs> I'm on a mini Wall Street that's not on Wall Street. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial again. This is Bonnie from Manhattan, New York. Be blessed. It's Abu Sain. Mm -hmm.